from WBNY News, this is First Morning Weather. Well, welcome back. It's a chilly night across the Twin Tiers. We're looking at uh, variably cloudy skies, occasional flurries and snow showers passing through. Some areas have picked up some very minor accumulations. Uh, Maybe a couple slick spots on some of the secondary roads, but again, accumulations generally well under an inch. Uh, it's also on the windy side, and that's driving wind chill values down into the teens. That'll continue to be an issue for our Wednesday, Valentine's Day. Uh, but at least we'll see increasing amounts of sunshine as we progress through the day. So Crystal City Sky Cam right now, again, just showing a couple flurries in the air from time to time. But again, not much in the way of accumulation. Earlier today, we had a high temperature of 40 degrees, so about four degrees above average for this time of year. We started the day off at 29. Normal low this time of year, 16 degrees, and we're certainly expecting a below average day for tomorrow. So here's what we're tracking at this late hour. A weak area of low pressure pushing east out of the Great Lakes region. You can see the blue on the map, indicative of some flurries and snow showers, most of which is on the light side. Where you see the darker shades of blue, that's where there may be a, a quick burst of uh, some heavier snow, but it doesn't last for very long in any one particular spot. And again, these are kind of working their way rather quickly off towards the east. But right now near Ridgeberry and then over towards Waverly and Sayre, uh, Nichols and Barton down towards Wyndham Township in Pennsylvania. We are seeing some of these light snow showers passing through. Temperature in Ridgeberry right now at 26 degrees. It's 28 in Westfield, 27 in Canastillo, and 27 in Penyan. But again, that doesn't tell the whole weather story. It's because of the breezy conditions out there driving the wind chills down into the teens. So for our Valentine's Day, no issues with any snow, so that's good news. And if you have a date night tomorrow night, should be good to go. But definitely need to bundle up for sure because temperatures tomorrow night heading down to the teens and lower 20s. During the afternoon hours, will slowly rise here into the lower 30s with increasing amounts of sunshine. The winds, though, will remain brisk. We're going to look at frequent wind gusts here for tomorrow topping 20 miles an hour, occasionally up to 25 to 30 across some of the higher terrain. The winds gradually easing after sunset uh, tomorrow evening. We'll be looking at uh, wind gusts dropping back down to between 10 and 15 miles an hour. Now, as far as weather features of interest, high pressure slides in from the Ohio Valley tomorrow, and that's why we're thinking we have decent amount of sunshine and no snow. But what's going to happen, a wave of low pressure, Kind of like the one that's passing through tonight will work its way through the Great Lakes region. Limited moisture associated with it, but Thursday we run the risk for some snow showers and looks like they'll taper off here heading into Friday morning. Uh, beyond that, it looks like dry for most of Friday afternoon. Could be another weak system moving through on Saturday. Now in terms of snowfall accumulations as we head through the day Thursday with that next week weather system coming through, not seeing much uh, most areas across our region uh, anywhere between uh, a coating to perhaps an inch and uh, that's about it so again nothing significant in terms of snowfall accumulations and temperature wise we're stuck pretty much in the 30s here through sunday finally as we head into early next week we'll start to see those temperatures rise back up into the 40s but we'll call it just seasonably cold here over the next several days 38 is what we forecast today ended up hitting 40 for our official high temperature. Still a couple flurries and snow showers out there tonight. Otherwise, variably cloudy and breezy. Lows right around 20. 33 for our Valentine's Day. It will remain on the brisk side. Thursday, a couple late day snow showers possible. We're dry Friday. A few more snow showers again on Saturday. Dry Sunday, then the early next week, we keep it dry with temperatures rising into the lower 40s.